2010. 2010 was the last time the Phoenix Suns made it to their conference finals. The Phoenix Suns defeated the Denver Nuggets 125-118 in game four of their second round series. That means their 11 year drought is finally over and the Suns are shining again. Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to The Sports Geek. I'm your host, Taylor Brennan. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you never miss an episode. Now, 11 years is a long time to not make it to the conference finals. But this past weekend, the Suns changed it all by sweeping the Nuggets and making it into their conference finals. And they are the first team in NBA history to go to the conference finals after entering the current season with a 10-year playoff drought. The Suns are also the first team to lead by at least 20 points in five consecutive playoff games during the last 25 seasons. And for the point god himself, Chris Paul, this is his first ever career sweep. Chris Paul fought through his shoulder injury during the first round against the Lakers and shined even brighter during game four against the Nuggets where he scored 37 points. Paul finished the series with a 25 and a half point scoring average on 61.8% shooting, 58% from the three and 100% from the foul line. At 36, he truly does own the title point god. The Suns will take on the winner of the Jazz vs. Clippers series next. The series continues tonight, where the Jazz are up 2-1 over the Clippers. Utah is still favored to win the series with negative 175 odds, with the Clippers inching close at plus 155. Jazz leader Donovan Mitchell says he is fine after leaving the fourth quarter of Game 3 with an ankle injury, but the Clippers are right on their tail. Any slight misfortune for the Jazz could come out a victory for the Clippers. For the Western Conference win, the Suns have now narrowed the gap between them and the Jazz at plus 120 for Utah and plus 135 for Phoenix. The Suns are also in third with the best odds to win the NBA title at plus 350 at sportsbetting.ag, with Utah at plus 340 and Brooklyn at plus 225. With the playoffs dwindling down, the stakes have never been higher. I'm excited for the Suns. This has obviously been a long time coming for both the Suns and Chris Paul. The talent on this team, including Devin Booker, makes for a true force to be reckoned with. And I don't know, I have a feeling they're going all the way. But make sure you tune in tonight for the Jazz Clippers game. And for the Sports Geek, I'm Taylor Brennan. Thank you for watching.